JJJ, you already know, it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. CodingPhase.com, your boy is back and out and did it again. All right, so today's topic is, let's talk about a little bit about what's going on with React and Facebook's uh, licensing of React and the patent and all of that stuff, right? So, what do I think? First of all, I'm not a lawyer. None of us here are lawyers. I mean, you know, most of us. <laughs> We're not lawyers, so we don't know exactly how this thing works. We know is that, you know, React is supposed to be sort of open source, but not really. Um, basically, you can use it for any project, but like, from my understanding is, Facebook is also trying to protect itself, because Facebook uses React everywhere, and is using it in their own applications, um, React Native, and this and that, right? So, people are, are, are basically flipping out, they're like, oh my god, uh, React didn't, uh, well, Facebook didn't uh, reissue their licensing, and whatever, whatever, right? Now, I will say this, man, if I was Facebook, I would do the same thing. I want a patent that's gonna protect React Right, and it's gonna say, hey, whenever Facebook uses it, like everybody should know, like, hey, this is ours, right? The idea that people think it's gonna be like, hey, this is open source, completely open source, and, and everybody should should own it. Nah, Facebook is paying a lot of developers a lot of money. You know, this guy's making two hundred thousand dollars. Imagine in a team of 10, 20 people, how much money that is, right? You know, two hundred thousand dollars each to keep on working on React. Like, yeah, some people get to contribute and, and do a little change here and there, but the people that are really making the big changes and, and, and adding all the cool shit are the people that work for Facebook. So Facebook is the one that that's really investing into this, right? So how do you expect for Facebook to to say, hey, you know what? Let's do this completely open source. We pay for it. We, we don't own it no more. We're going to give it to the community. They can't do that. Especially when, let's say an example, a situation where, let's say a company comes out with a new product in React Native, and then they try to patent that, that new product. Let's say an application or whatever, a workflow that they might have. right? And they try to patent it. Now, because React uh, is being used on Facebook, now they could literally sue Facebook for it because they already patented it, right? So it's whoever patents that first. That's from my understanding. That's how it works. It's like if I, if I patent something before you, even though you created it, I'm the one that own it. So now, basically, I can sue you who is the creator. Like shit like that happens all the time. Have you ever, uh, you guys never heard of that shit? Like, you never heard of uh, fucking people being sued because of the word podcast and, and using numbers on, on your podcast, like number in your podcast? People get sued for that because somebody created a patent for it. Or even like, you know, people go and create patents for technologies that haven't been even created. Like somebody already has a patent for an airplane that that is also a car or you know a car that's an airplane there's already a patent for um a watch inside of the person's skin has it been created no but people already have a patent on it so it's like this shit happens all the time guys so facebook is just trying to protect itself you know so don't freak out don't be like oh my god i can't use react because it's not really open source and and facebook owns it no facebook owns it but Facebook has in the licensing from my understanding from what I overread and just went over it, right? Basically, it's like you could use it for your projects. It's just it's very clear who owns it, who owns React, right? Like you could own a project. You just cannot sue Re on fucking Facebook. You can't sue Facebook for using React. That's all they really did. They just protected themselves. It's like people are looking for those loopholes, guys. People are looking for loopholes to, to try to fuck Facebook out of their own stuff. Like, they do that shit all the time. 
look what uh, what is it? Apple has gone through with with Galaxy, like Samsung. Like you know how many times they've sued each other back and forth, like a million times because every time that that um, Apple comes out with something new, Samsung was right there copying the shit out of it, just every single thing. And then of course after a certain amount of time. Apple started, you know, switching up their their whole model, and what they wanted to do was just make more money and try to milk people. So then they wasn't uh, creating new technologies and new new things for the people. They were reusing the same phone, and basically Samsung at the end came out winning because Samsung always comes out with something new. Doesn't matter if it's the fingerprint thing. Doesn't matter if it's. Um, you know, like the camera, the, the quality of the camera, like there's so much shit that Samsung has taken from Apple, but then now they've already passed it. Now iPhone is copying the Galaxy. You know what I mean? So, yeah, so like this is like a technical thing. Like this shit happens by default. Every company wants to protect itself. They just have to put those patents, you know, patents out to basically protect themselves. You can't be mad at it. People are freaking out. They're like, oh my God, we this thing is owned by Facebook. We can't use React. No, man, calm down. You know, pull your panties up and just relax, man. Like, stop acting like this shit is like the end of the world. Like, you should know that. Like, if you create something, why would you give it out to the world and say, hey, you guys own it? No, you got to put it out there and be like, we own this and then you could use it. That's what React did. That's what Facebook did. They're like, hey, man, anybody can use this. Go ahead, use it. We're not going to sue you. We're not going to, to uh, you know, mess with your shit. But at the same time, we're the ones that created this. You know what I mean? So that's just how it is. But, yeah, man. I just got back to work, man. I'll see you guys later, man. Stop flipping out, guys. Just take it easy. Relax. Just chill. Don't worry. Keep on using React. You're going to be fine. It's not the end of the world. You're not going to die from, you know, React being owned by Facebook. All right, guys? And like I said, man, check out my website, codingface.com. I have a whole bunch of free tutorials. I also have some premium courses there. Trust me, guys, you're going to learn a lot from me, man. If you listen to your boy, it's like I give you zero nonsense, you know, zero bullshit. It's just like straight to the point. So, yeah, man, you already know. It's your boy Joe back at it again, codingface.com.